Welcome back to Now or Never Adventures. We are a family of four trying to live our life a little differently than the norm. So after being in Sifnus for two nights, one night it was on a key and one night in Anchorage which was awful. Rolly swell coming in all night, didn't get much sleep. Um, we now decided to go to Dios or Ios. Um, so we've got some winds coming, they'll tell me come in about Tuesday. So we're just going to Yos to get some more fuel and then we're gonna move further down towards Kos and um, go across to Turkey. So we just decided to do some extra miles uh, before it gets really windy and really swelly again. Um, it is really calm right now, not much wind, however uh, there is still swell coming in. Let's see. Let's see. Not much to do. Go another couple of hours and we'll be in Eos. shaken up um, crazy crazy so we decided not to go into the port and go around the corner and anchor off and see what else we can get fuel um, but that was scary it was coming in so quick um, it's crazy not not a bit negligent to be honest with you so we just have a look at this anchorage and hopefully we'll be all right for the night okay so we're we're gonna rest here tonight looks like quite a nice place. You've got a nice yellow beach, sandy beach. And we're going to figure out how we're going to do fuel. Maybe we'll have to use a taxi to go to uh, the next town in Ios and uh, get a few jugs or not. Okay, so we moved because it was really, really swelly. And if you can see in the distance up there, behind the sailboat, there's, there's goats up there. And you can hear their, hear their bells. So we have, we have uh, crystal clear blue water, aqua blue. Uh, we're at 4.6 meters. Got a couple of beaches along here. We're on the southern tip of Ios right now. Uh, we should be good for tonight.
uh, but I'm not sure if he can get back up. <laughs> oh, he's gonna blow him around. So it's um, jumping between like a 17 and 25. Um, nice and protected under here isn't it? Yeah. So this is our sea state at the moment which is not too bad considering the other uh, last night was really swelly so this is actually we can probably definitely sleep through this um, obviously one of us is gonna anchor watch for a little bit but uh, yeah so, it's not bad it's, it's um, a bit cooler in the evenings around here. I think that's the mountain where all the wind's coming from. You can see from here, you can see lights of Fira, which is where Santorini is, about 20 nautical miles away. I always want to go there. <laughs> I think that's the closest I get to Santorini for now. So. It's about one o'clock in the morning and the wind has died down a bit but it's still gusting probably around mid-twenties um, I'm just doing anchor watch for a couple of hours and then swap with Chris so, so far everything is good but it's all in place this one more catamaran came in the night apparently so yeah it's interesting a lot of, i can see lots of planes flying in and out from santorini uh, yeah interesting now the moon is out so it's a bit brighter so you can actually see the rocks <laughs> um, so in case we drag we're able to see well and also doing um watch on um, Navionics as well, the movement of the boat. So yeah. Gotta look after our home. Sandy Beach, but we walked up. There's tennis and one hoop basketball court. Oh yeah, it's one hoop. Is that our boat there? Uh, my daddy is to the There's Nona over there. Oh! Three, two, one, run! No! Haha! <laughs> I don't know what you can see, but I was just about to bring the chain up. There's lots of these flat fish on our chain. I'm not sure what they're doing, but let's have a look when I start bringing it up. What will happen? Still there. Still there. <laughs> Are they gonna fall in the chain? Maybe. See our chain through the water so clear. Yeah, they're following. They're following the... 
following my chain. You see our anchor just there, dugging well. Turkey. Look at this water, amazing. So it's time to leave Ios and Vios Manganari Bay. We've been here from Miltemi um, at gas up to 34 knots um, and it's windy but all held well and now we're moving on onto our next destination which is an island of Amogos, 33 nautical miles, which takes about five hours, hopefully we get some sailing done, currently no wind. Um, got the captain here. Uh, need to get some fuel and some food. Island of Santorini just now. Survive Miltemi. Last time to be rolling. Uh, it's not wind, it's well. So I think I prefer a little bit of wind. <laughs> Where are we going? We're going to, to Amorals. Amorals, yes. Do, 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 do. Yeah, it sounds like the game that they like to watch Among Us. Yeah, we played it before. So we've got five knots and we've got no, no, no wind. So we're having to motor a little bit. Now, not sure if you can see in the distance there's a catamaran, I think you can. It is over here. That's our friend Nick. We've met Nick, he's from London and we're going to be 
sailing along with him over the next couple of days on our way over to Turkey. Hopefully we're going to be in Turkey uh, checking into Bodrum on Saturday. Uh, Saturday or Sunday is our plan. Thank you very much for getting this far in the video. Seeing as you're here, why not click the like button and if you're not already, click the subscribe as well. See you in the next video.